Hey everyone, welcome back to Dan's how-to videos. Today I'm going to be showing you how to pair your Apple keyboard with various devices. First I'll be showing you how to pair it with your iPhone, iPad, iPad mini or iPod touch and then I'll be showing you how to pair it with various other devices using the Nexus 7. Now this will work on pretty much any device as long as you have Bluetooth capabilities available to you. The process should be pretty much the same. Anyway, let's get started with the tutorial. All right, so I've got the Apple keyboard ready. I've got my Nexus 7 already, and I have my iPhone 5 ready. Now this is going to work, as I said, on any iOS device and pretty much any tablet that has Bluetooth capabilities. Now before you can get started with this, you need to make sure that your keyboard is not paired with anything. So if it's paired with your computer, you need to go into your system preferences or system settings and disable that, and then you'll be able to connect it with your iPad or tablet or phone. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do is get started with the iPhone, and this is gonna be the tutorial for anybody who has an iOS device. So once you have your keyboard unpaired with anything, you can go ahead and open up the settings application on your iOS device, and then you need to go to the Bluetooth section. Now if your Bluetooth is off, you need to swipe it on. If it's on, then what you need to do is just wait for it to discover the device. Now if your iPhone or iPad isn't finding the device, what you need to do is press the little power button on the side of your keyboard there, and it'll pop up with a green light, and that should help the process and uh, make your keyboard known. Once your keyboard has been found, you need to enter in the little code that pops up, this one being 8873, so we'll type that in. And then you want to hit the enter return button, and it should connect it. Once it's all connected, you can pretty much use the keyboard like you would with any device. So I've opened up the notes app here, and I'm just going to show you that it works. So I'm going to type in, I am using the Apple keyboard. And everything works. If I push backspace, it will delete everything and you're pretty much good to go. Now this will be probably more useful for somebody with an iPad rather than an iPhone or iPod Touch. Anyway, let's move on to the Nexus 7. Now connecting your keyboard to the Nexus 7 is pretty much the same process. You need to have Bluetooth enabled, but before you can get started, you wanna make sure you've unpaired your keyboard with any device. Once you've done that, you can go into the settings on your Nexus 7 or tablet. You wanna to go to Bluetooth, and you wanna make sure that it's turned on. So whatever tablet you're using, whether it be a Windows tablet or an iPad or a Nexus tablet, just swipe on the top or wherever it shows you and turn the Bluetooth on. Once your keyboard is found, what you want to do is tap on it and again you'll need to type in the password so I'm going to go ahead and type that in this time the password is different so it's going to be 692776 and then you want to press the enter return button on the keyboard and it should connect once it's connected you can just simply open up a notepad and give it a test so we'll open up the notepad here and we'll just test I am using the keyboard the Apple keyboard on my Nexus 7. All right guys, so that's pretty much how you connect your Apple keyboard to various devices. It's very easy. If you have any problems, feel free to leave a comment in the description down below. Also hit the like button, it helps me out. I post videos Monday through Friday, so subscribe up top to be notified when I post a new one. It's free to do so. Anyway guys, thanks for watching. I will see you in the next one.